Hey guys, let's start with the Euro US dollar. Today we saw a break of this steep newly established trend line and already a pullback that confirmed this trend line. Now we are ready to make it to this uptrend line and maybe even break it. The US dollar index is a bit weaker and if the dollar index bounces back, bounces up on this trend line then and the strength of the Euro US dollar keeps on, then the Euro US dollar can turn around a bit higher, so it does not have to make it fully to this trend line. And it's um, it's interesting how how strong the Euro US dollar is, especially when you see the divergence to the to the bond market. The bond market is about to make a new low. I have a signal long here. And yeah, you know, sentiment wise. A few weeks ago, you, you, you can probably remember that the news were like, oh, how many rate cuts will we see? Will it be four or five or six rate cuts in 2024? And this week I heard the first voices talking about rate hikes. So that's a nice shift in the sentiment. And together with this um, A, B, C correction of this one two three four five move this is like an invitation to go long especially when we make a slightly lower low here and in fact it does not need to be the right cuts but a drop in the stock market could be a nice trigger too. Now this um, extreme rise took took four months. If we now see a correction of this four month move and I just yesterday got a new new signal short that confirms it. If we now see a correction, that could be the trigger for a rise in the bond market because a lot of money could rotate from the stock market into the bond market. Yeah. So much for today. Just my personal trading diary, no trading advice.